I had lost the, I had, I think not lost. I think I forgot. The guy that you saw that time forgot why he loves seem, what he does. You didn't seem happy that No, day. man, because it all started to get to me. They, they, I allowed the, my ego or my false self, my insecurity, my fear to get in the way of of being present. It's what as simple as that. Of? I sound what? like Jim Carrey now. No, what were you afraid of? Um, oh, the fa- listen, it's, it was one thing to have it all, but then the thought that I could somehow lose it, the thought that, you know, the careers have arcs and how could mine have an arc? There was no arc. It was just starting and wanting to do this and all of a sudden just uh, going into the stratosphere with no, seemed, it seemed no limit in sight. And so instead of me just sitting there as this naive kid going, oh my God, I'm doing it. I can't believe I, I'm doing what I love and I'm, and boy, I make money and I'm, I'm living this life and I have a beautiful wife and I, I couldn't do that because I'm a, you know, I'm a, I'm a, like every human being, it seems, or, you know, I'm, you know, it's, it's easy to hate on yourself and easy to, to let the fear get in, that insecurity get in. And, um, you know, look at, I, obviously with what happened to me, I just, I got a great sense of clarity and I realized how honestly ridiculous it was for me to ever, to ever have worried, to ever have been insecure, to ever had any fear. Uh, I know what fear is now. I know what it is to be in a bad place. And let me tell you, that place I was in wasn't a bad place. I was just being a dumbass.